Hey everyone, this is Mr. B from Lamborghini For Me. Hope everyone enjoyed their holiday season last month. We are here at Manhattan Motor Cars in New York City, where they have one of the most prestigious luxury cars, exotic cars, and hyper cars you cannot find anywhere else in the country. Today, I will give you a walk around tour of this electrifying 2020 Lamborghini Huracan Evo Coupe. Let's go! This walk around tour of the 2020 Lamborghini Huracan Evo Coupe in Verde Mantis will be broken down into four parts. First, we will tackle the exterior portion of the Huracan Evo from its body, new enhanced parts and more. Next, we'll go inside the Huracan Evo and see its stunning interior. Next, we'll go over the Huracan Evo's performance from its powerful V10 engine to the new LDVI system. And last but not least, we'll wrap things up with a brief summary of the Huracan Evo Coupe in Verde Mantis, along with its price tag and who to contact to finance or lease this beautiful Lamborghini. All right, let's get started with the exterior tour. Without a doubt, Lamborghini Huracan is one of the most attractive and powerful V10 exotic cars in the world. The Huracan Evo is a step up from the Lamborghini V10 lineage, making it totally exclusive in its class. Starting off, as you can see here, with this epsilon shaped front bumper here that Lamborghini adores in their design. Integrated with the front spoiler, diffuser, and air curtain that makes different amongst the previous Huracan generations. This revamped front of the Huracan Evo helps the car stay planted during high speeds and turns. Next, we have the LED headlights of the Huracan Evo. You can see the outlines of the lights itself here and there. That cool white color of the headlights gives that super bright light with the perfect beam pattern. Also, the turn signals are crisp and visible as demonstrated. Bonnet line here and another bonnet line here. The bonnet lines are inspired by the Lamborghini Countach, which keeps the Lamborghini DNA present. This Huracan Evo Coupe is equipped with 20 inch Narvi forged wheels green calipers to go with the carbon ceramic brakes matching the performance and Verde Mantis exterior color. Here are the side air ducts that are standard now in the Huracan Evo Coupe, which was inspired from the one and only glorious Murcielago. We are heading to the back of this miraculous coupe to see more of its design. There are some notable changes that are on the Huracan Evo Coupe that makes it a class within itself. We have the Ypsilon shaped taillights right here that are iconic in the Lamborghini design for only the rear carbon grille as you can see and the high mounted exhaust right here. Similar to the Huracan Performante and the Aventador SVJ, these new high mounted titanium exhausts produce a thrilling exhaust note heard from around the block. Next, you see its huge rear diffuser that is not present with the previous Huracan models except for the Performante. It pushes airflow upwards, which increases the downforce of the Huracan Evo resulting in better gripping and better handling of the car. You see its integrated rear spoiler that is standard in all the Evos, which also increases the car's aerodynamics. Also, you see here the engine mounted in an engine bonnet, beautiful carbon fiber panels, thick quartz glass, a perfect optimal environment for the engine to power the Huracan Evo. All right, I'm unlocking the car starting the interior tour of the Huracan Evo Coupe. The coupe's interior is finished in Nera Ade and Verde Fanos, which matches the exterior Verde Mantis color. Very beautiful. Alcantara and carbon skin option is also in this coupe, which is a first for Lamborghini to have one of the most lightweight materials for a car's interior. I mean, just look how stunning the color combination is. Very soft. Look at, feel the seats. Very soft. Loving this color very much. All right, I'm going to hop inside right now. Okay, let's see if it has a cup holder. Wait, hold on. Uh, it's supposed to be here. Wait, no. No! <laughs> uh, it's all right. I mean, the pristine interior of this Huracan Evo Coupe makes up the absent cup holder as well. I mean, the Verde Funnest color, the Nero Day trim. Very good selection for this car again, as you can see right now. Beautiful.
All right, y'all, so I'm now in the driver's seat. Here's the wheel. Here's the 8.4 inch touchscreen, the HMI. I'll explain more about that later. That's the passenger side. You see more of the carbon trim. Ah, the start button. That's a good button right there. <laughs> Along with other buttons. See the dashboard, very clear, crisp. You got your Anima 3 driving modes here. You got your Corsa, you got your Sport, and you got your Strata. Depends on how you like to drive the Huracan Evo. Also changes on the dashboard as well. So you got this badass Corsa mode, then you got the Sport mode, then you got the Strata. Changes as well because you got ambient light that changes the mood of each performance. So you got the blue, you got the red, and you got the oranges depending on modes. Here's the ignition button that makes this car come to life along with other operative buttons as shown. Kind of press it through the cover hole or flip it, then press it. Um, let's see. It's kind of busy here, so we're not gonna start the engine this time, but you can hear it from our previous Huracan Evo video. Very loud. Lamborghini is not known for their optimal rear view window, as you can clearly see, but it does have two side mirrors that could show you any car that is either right next to you or stalking you when you are going cruising along in this Huracan Evo coupe. So here's the latest 8.4 inch human machine interface of the Huracan Evo, very similar to the Lamborghini Centenario, the main control system of the car. Here's the telephone, here's the sound, I'll go to the navigation, let this load. Okay, here's the navigation system with the 3D mapping that receives real time information on traffic. Pretty accurate. This is literally our location where we are, so. All right, so here is the storage space. I mean, <laughs> it's really tiny. It's not known for to carry maybe a golf bag or so, but you can see you can have two Huracan car kits. So while it's a travel bag, I mean, you gotta represent Lamborghini somewhere or another, right? Now it's time to go right into its promising performance that completes the revamp and evolution of the Huracan lineage. Let's open the rear and see its marvelous engine in full detail. Right there is where the engine bonnet encompasses the almighty 5.2 liter naturally aspirated V10 engine. Right there, the badge to make it official. It is identical and already appreciated for its outstanding performance on the Huracan Performante. Lamborghini re-engineered the engine with improved fluid dynamics and titanium exhaust and intake valves, which delivers 631 horsepower at 8,000 RPM, 423 pounds per foot of torque, goes from 0 to 62 miles per hour in 2.9 seconds and a top speed of 202 miles per hour all powered with a very responsive seven speed dual clutch transmission. All right, so I'm back inside the cockpit showing you the most important addition to its performance, the LDVI system. This supercomputer is the brain of the Huracan Evo, able to control and manage every driving aspect of the Huracan, from the front and rear axles, all four wheels. It is described and managed by the LDVI. This new technology syncs everything from the all-wheel drive and the all-wheel steering system. It's just really compelling to know and it's just great to see that this new technology brings out the optimal performance of this Huracan Evo. I mean, this is just, <sighs> this whole computer just controls the entire car. Okay, we are finally done with the walk-around tour of this 2020 Lamborghini Huracan Evo Coupe in Verde Mantis. Now, a brief summary. Man, this car is amazing. <laughs> I can't tell you enough about this car. This Huracan Evo Coupe is for any type of driver, from the sophisticated driver to a track star. The thrill, iconic design, and overall optimal comfort and performance of this car will be in demand for a long time, just as the previous Huracan models were doing. With all of these changes from its 5.2 liter V10 engine, notable exterior changes, and the new LDVI system, Lamborghini still kept his roots with its design, performance, and being naturally aspirated. As stated previously, the MSRP price for a Huracan Evo 
goes for about $261,274. This particular one in Verde Mantis, which includes the style package, navigation system, 20 inch Navi rims, and other options you have seen in this tour, the price is well over $300,000. The Huracan Evo Coupe is a miraculous car and should be in someone's garage. So in order to get this particular one or order one to your liking, contact Ms. Viviana, the Lamborghini specialist of Manhattan Motor Cars, who will pin a direct number for you to call below. Special thanks to Ms. Viviana and to the Manhattan Motor Cars family for allowing us to tour this beautiful Huracan Evo Coupe in Verde Mantis. Here at Lamborghini For Me, we are here to get you the Lamborghini of your dreams. Take care everybody.